Morning folks, Dennis Jr. here with Zager Guitars in Lincoln, Nebraska uh, with my father sitting beside me here in uh, our recording studio and today we're going to focus uh, on our Zager parlor size guitar and our parlor size guitar is this one right here but I kind of wanted to get them in a lineup for you so you could see the differences in sizes and uh, I'll just read them off from left to right here this guitar on the end is our travel size and you'll notice uh, it's about two inches shorter than our parlor next to it. But the box is just a little bit smaller where, where on our parlor it's just a little bit fuller and bigger. But overall the parlor is not much bigger of a guitar. The neck sizes are exactly the same. Uh, it's just that the neck is positioned a little higher on the body on, on the parlor. That's why you see just a little bit of height difference here. Bigger box give you a deeper tone. Yeah, but you'll notice on this the bigger box um, you know, I have a lot of customers who can't decide between the, 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 the travel on the left and the parlor on the right. Unless you need the absolutely smallest guitar, I almost always recommend the parlor here uh, in the middle. And that's because it's, it's about the same size as the travel, not a whole lot bigger, but uh, it produces a much bigger sound because of the shape and the size of the box. Uh, and then we move up to our OM size here, which you notice is it's, it's significantly bigger. And with that, you get an even bigger sound. And then on the end here, we got our, our Zad 50 CE, our full-size guitar, which is going to get you a bigger sound yet. But I just kind of wanted to line these up so you could see the disparity in size and, and the differences between our four sizes of guitars, uh, hopefully help you make a better decision. But I'm going to grab the, oh, uh, the uh, parlor here. I'm going to put it in my father's hands so he can play it a little bit for you, and we can talk just a little bit about it. I'll get up close and be quiet so you can hear it. Very uh, warm, big sound. We have a lot of folks coming from the Baby Taylors going to this guitar, uh, the, the Small Martins, and a lot of the reason they're coming from what I hear from our customers is the sound quality difference. Uh, our guitars, because they're braced a little thinner, they sound bigger. And beyond that, you also have that great playability factor. So, um, I don't know, two cents of knowledge there. Um, as far as changes, this is the new 2015, you'll notice, and on the 15s we have our Z in abalone on, uh, on the fretboard, as you can see, that we're very proud of. Um, you know, it's funny, I had a customer the other day who uh, called him. He, he, just got his, he, he, he just got his parlor and he loved the guitar, but he was wondering why it didn't, uh, why, the, why the dots weren't all exactly the same color like like his, um, I'm not going to name the name, but he paid more for it than ours. And uh, we, we finally realized he had plastic fret markers. Ours are true abalone inlay. Um, we build our small guitars just like our big guitars. Uh, no, you, you know a lot of these guitars will have plastic nuts. We use real bone for our nuts. We use real abalone inlay, not fake plastic. We use real Grover tuners. These are the same Grover tuners on our $2,500 Zad 900 CE. Okay, so real quality. Also this year, we have the same headstock as our 80 and 900 series guitars on this guitar. So we've really, you know, upped the ante here. It's a, it's a very high quality acoustic hand-built custom guitar. Um, and as usual, we use the uh, Tusk saddles on, on this, just like our 980 series. Tusk, uh, you know, uh, we've used bone in the past, but we've we've had better response with the with the Tusk. It's a little newer technology. Um, a, a, as with all Zagers, you know, we we go with tradition first. But when it doesn't make sense, uh, we will always favor and uh, go in favor of technology. And we're finding the Tusk. Our customers are saying who are coming from these other um, very high level instruments are, are you know our pros who are traveling on the road performing with these things are saying they're like they're liking the resonation better with the tusk saddles and again those are all hand carved by my father uh, flip it over on the back we can see it uh, he signs all guitars when he's finished with his work let's get down here to the strap pin if you see any marks on it it's a shop guitar you know we don't we don't go crazy cleaning all these up uh, before. We just kind of grab one off the line and just demonstrate it as is. So if you, when you get yours, it'll look better than this guitar. Let's look at the inside of it quick. You can see, this is guitar number 18. 
So if you're lucky enough to, well, this one's a shop, so it might go into discount when we're done here. Look for it there, you might get a special price on it. But uh, as far as the uh, parlor size guitars, if you're a smaller player, um, excellent. You notice my dad gets his arm around it very easily. You could pull this guitar in close on the sofa. Um, again, if you're wanting a bigger sound than this, then I would move right up to our OM size guitar. And you'll see we have about five different models in the OM size. And that's a significantly bigger guitar. You know, it's, uh, it's going to have a little bit bigger sound. They're a little more expensive uh, than the parlors. But for, if you want a smaller guitar without the smaller sound, um, this would be the guitar I'd recommend. Uh, a lot of women uh, we have who, who are smaller in stature love this guitar. My, my mother plays one, she's five foot one, just loves it to death. Um, if, if you want the absolute smallest guitar with even a big sound, I'm just comparing amongst our own our own line here. This is going to be, have the small, our travel size here is going to have our, our the smallest sound of all our guitars because it's our, our smallest guitar. That's just the physics of the whole thing. Um, but we have a lot of customers also coming from, you know, the Martins and Taylor smaller guitar who go to our travel guitar who, who like it better for its sound. So beyond the playability. So if you want the absolute smallest, I would recommend the travel. But um, this is a wonderful, um, if you still want that big sound in a small guitar package, this is the guitar I'd recommend. Uh, along with our great playability, I'll let you listen a little bit more here. that little riff you did earlier on it, I was hearing you play. Nice, full, rich sound, especially for a small guitar. So, hopefully this helped you out a little bit, folks. Do remember, uh, with all Zager guitars, 100% money back guarantee, lifetime warranty. You're not out a penny to try one at any time. And uh, if you have any other questions uh, like that, don't be afraid to call or email. Someone's here to help you seven days a week. Me and my father are in the shop almost every day, it seems, lately, either building or, or doing these videos. So until next video, take care, folks.